Shalom. Peace, love, and light to the trap. It's your boy, Chief Fuqua. My, you already know we align with the divine every time I make a video. So as you can see from the title, this video is on why you should work on yourself before entering a relationship. So we just gonna go ahead and jump straight into this video because I've been wanting to make this for a while. And it's just the way that relationships are going in the 21st century and just what I've been able to observe, you know, just as what's going on with the collective hopping in relationships is just kind of weird right now and people just don't really know how to you know just operate as far as you know relationships so one thing that we have to really just be able to nail into our head and understand is that we live inside of a greco-roman society okay what does this mean a greco-roman society everything that we know as far as relationships everything that we think we know as far as relationships and what it means to be in a relationship what it means to you know be a masculine uh, man in a relationship and a feminine female in a relationship is all given to us based off you know the roman society and what is the roman society what is the greco-roman society it's the law of reversal right they flipped a lot of the roles and a lot of the the responsibilities of the ma the man in the relationship and the female in the relationship and what that does is that creates you know tension it creates you know a lot of chaos and uh, it creates just so many things that can just create so many operational variables that can really just damage a relationship in general not only that right everything that we see uh as a relationship just coming up as in our childhood was based off you know a lot of the things that we've seen inside of you know movies that are very unrealistic you know like such things such as like disney movies and stuff like that and romance and things like that and what a lot of people don't really see and don't realize is that romance comes from what rome right and i'm not saying there's anything wrong with romance but i'm just saying it is an agenda right and they are trying to create a certain you know mind state around relationships in general right so we have to understand that not only that right a lot of us are brought up into broken households, right? What do I mean? I mean, we have broken family structures just growing up in general. We never had an opportunity to see what it's like to have, you know, a good equilibrium within the family household, meaning that the father and the mother were working in unison to try to make things work in a, in a unique way, right? So a lot of us are growing up in households where it's already broken, right? It's already uh the the foundation is already not there and it's not and it's not moving in the right type of energy that it needs to move in right a lot of us were missing fathers in our house a lot of us were missing mothers in our house right so with that right we already we already got fucked up in the head you know what i'm saying so we have to be able to understand that and once we do that once we be able to to visit our past and visit you know the karma that we've experienced just growing up and seeing uh, a lot of the things about relationships and how it was given to us in a faulty sense right and we learn to heal from that then we can actually begin to step into you know what it is that we have to do in order for ourselves to bring healthy relationships into our lives so one of the main reasons why we need to be working on ourselves before entering a relationship is because first of all you probably already broken right and i'm not saying that in a negative light what i'm trying to say is you don't know what it is that you even want in a relationship and in order for you to find out what it is that you want and what you need in a relationship you have to spend that time with yourself and understanding yourself and loving yourself in order for you to find this and once you do that once you understand what it is that what you require in a relationship you can build yourself up so that when you do get into a relationship, when you do attract that partner into your life, right? You are utilizing the law of attraction, right? Becoming what it is that you want to manifest or what it is that you want to create within your reality, right? Once you do that, now you're able to reciprocate that exact same energy, right? Because a lot of us try to get into relationships for the lack of what it is that we lack, right? And what that does is it creates problems within the relationship because now you're doing it from a from a from a position of needing right because you don't think that you have this but if you worked on yourself if you decided to to go within yourself and figure out what it is within you that you that you truly need to get from a relationship or what you truly 
uh you know want from a relationship right then you could actually you could actually try your best to you know deliver this into the relationship as well so like i said earlier one of the main reasons that a lot of our relationships fail and that we need to be able to build ourselves and we need to work on ourselves and relationships is because you don't know who you are right and a lot of us are out here looking right to something external or a person external to fill the void within ourselves that we will never be able to fill by searching for something external like i said you have to be able to look within yourself and find that love within yourself in order for you to fulfill that right and once you do that then you can actually start to work towards attracting that partner into your life that's going to be loving and caring right so you have to be able to be loving and caring to yourself and touching back on you know us being in this greco-roman society understand that a lot of the things have been flipped and reversed right we don't understand what it means to be a true you know masculine male in a relationship and to be a healthy masculine energy in a relationship and a lot of us don't understand what it means to be a true feminine being in a relationship as well so one thing is this right we as men have to understand that our value is based off what we build we have to build our value within this lifestyle within this lifetime we have to be able to build our value so what it is that we build ourselves up to right is go this is what our value is and if you don't take the time if you don't take time out to actually build yourself up as a man right you're not going to be able to attract a woman who has value within herself as well and one thing about women is your value is based upon you know you your value is is how do i say this your value has to be preserved right because female energy is already more pure than male energy in and of itself right female energy is already way more pure right so you have to be able to hold that energy within yourself because over time you know what i'm saying people know how so i works. want you to ask yourself this question especially if you're looking for a relationship right is it fair right to your future significant other that if you get into a relationship right now today and you flunked out right shout out dola the pilot and you flunked out is that fair to your significant other right that you go and get into a relationship bringing all this past trauma into your relationship absolutely not right and this is what's happening all the time people are getting out of relationships and hopping right into new relationships this is so freaking toxic like i don't understand why people do this it's really just a lack of self-love so we really really need to you know be able to love ourselves you know love ourselves inside and out before we even hop into relationships because all it's doing is just creating more and more trauma and we done with the trauma bonding right we we elevating and getting into newer heights and finding newer heights within ourselves we we don't have time to just sit back and and bond on on, on the things that lower our frequencies and our vibrations bro we have to rise you know what i'm saying we have to so moral of the story is this right work on you work on accomplishing your goals work on becoming a better version of yourself work on you know just loving yourself inside and out okay and then begin to manifest right then begin to utilize the law of attraction well actually that's already utilizing the law of attraction you know you becoming what it is that you want to attract so with that being said right that's why you need to work on yourself before entering a relationship because for the most part if you don't work on yourself you're just going to attract all the broken parts of yourself from another person right and then you're going to be sitting back wondering like why do I keep attracting the same kind of relationships into my life, right? That's because you're not doing the self-work. So do the self-work. Do what it is, what it takes in order for you to grow inside internally and love yourself, right? Because nobody's going to be able to love you like you can love yourself. But anyways, that's been the video. It's your boy, Chief Fuqua. You already know more shit on the way. Let's get it.